Hello everyone, this is Charles Bridgetech with another product review, this time on a Yammerin R5 voice recorder. Now this is a stereo voice recorder and uh, they contacted me via email and they wanted me to test and review their products and here it is. They do have an Amazon store so let's wait no further and let's open this up and see what's in. comes with a USB charging cable comes with a dear customer note there for you and it comes with a pretty thick user manual alright so let's get to the voice recorder now this is a really heavy unit right off hand. I have to admit this is solid metal on this. Really nice. I'll go ahead and take this shield off here so we can see the display a little better. Now these are the microphones up top. very heavy metal construction on this now this does have 8 gigs of onboard memory there's the charging port now this one you cannot expand the memory on it so you are stuck with the memory uh, maximum that's built into it okay so we're gonna go ahead and turn it on now it does have a let me turn it down a little bit okay so this does have a this does have a built-in mp3 player uh, well, you can play mp3s on this as well so we're going to go into the menu that's the screen there now it's not a colored screen so we're going to go ahead and change it to format here we're going to go to the other type of uh, format that's in here so now we're going to go to the recording modes so now we're going to go ahead and set this up to record so let's see how it does red light comes on there as you can see the LED microphone output volume level meters there are showing my voice when it does so I'm going to go ahead and talk with it this far out and that's about two feet away from my face so now I'm going to bring it up close and we're going to test it now testing one two three testing one two three Alright, so now I'm going to bring it back over here, and we're going to stop the recording here. Alright, shows that it was saved. So now we're going to go ahead and play it back. Red light comes on there, as you can see. The we're going to turn it up here a little bit. Now this microphone is quite a bit louder here. So now I'm going to bring it up close and we're going to test it now. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Alright, so now I'm going to bring it back over here and we're going to stop the recording here. Alright, well, that's um, pretty impressive. This thing is pretty loud. Um, I've tested another uh, voice recorder that was barely audible in my opinion 
uh, to really hear your voice recordings. But this is clearly um, loud enough. Uh, that was on maximum volume. Uh, you don't have to have it up that loud. But in any case, the microphone was picking up uh, pretty much everything that I was saying with clear detail, very crisp and clear uh, audio on that speaker as well as the recording, which is really nice. Okay, so now I'm going to go through the menu settings. So just to go to show you there, you can do the play settings, recording settings. Oh, I hit the wrong one, sorry. We're going to go to the menu settings here. We're going to go through them so you guys can see. Shows a lot of different settings in here. So more than enough settings to to definitely set this up the way you want it to do. Now as far as the quality of the screen, with this one light output, it's not that bad. It's got a pretty decent display on there. It's not a colored screen. So all in all, this has got a really nice quality sound coming from this unit, which is pretty nice as well. And then we're going to go ahead and power it off. And you keep holding that until it counts down to three, and then it shuts off. So my final thoughts on this unit. It's built very well. Solid unit. Uh, expandable memory. It may be discouraging for some people, but if you keep the quality at a minimum, or if you want to keep it at the high and the highest uh, quality in recording. Okay, so you keeping the highest quality uh, recordings possible, you're going to get quite a bit of run time, recording time that is, from the 8 gigs that's built into this. So, a uh, very nice unit. It's got a nice style to it, nice feel, very nice semi gloss uh, metal construction. Uh, feels very solidly well built. Um, so I'm, I'm not seeing any issues with it. I just want to thank again Yemeren for sending me this to review. They have an Amazon store so if you're interested I'll leave a link down in the description. Again I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did please share, like, and subscribe. That way I can bring more of these type of products to you in the future. Thanks for watching. Take care.